So what is going on guys, it's Triple G here back with another Borderlands 3 video and today we have a new fastest Iridian farm. It is a lot faster than the Ruiner and any other places that are in the game right now. Guys, if you enjoyed this video, please consider subscribing to the channel or join us over on Twitch. We stream five times a week and otherwise, let's get straight into this video. So with today's Hotfix, Gearbox have added a 500 Iridium prize pool for completing the slaughter shafts now this is directly linked to the final boss so now you can go into the slaughter shafts and kill the final boss and get that 500 iridian now you can do the final round in the slaughter shaft in under five minutes meaning that you can kill all the way up to tremendous wrecks then get your 500 iridian and jump off the critical bit is to make sure that you leave another enemy alive because you're going to kill yourself respawn in and just do those few waves to get back to tremendous rex tremendous rex and the cistern of slaughter is the fastest one because you don't have to worry about trying to kill yourself in the slaughter shaft and the actual slaughter star 3000 is a pain in the ass to do anyway as you can get those flying enemies get stuck so compare this, you have 5 minutes and you get 500 Iridian, which is a run at the raid boss. Or you can do 10 Ruiner runs where you'll get an average between 40 to 60 from the Ruiner. But you have to account in for those low times coming in and out of the map. Plus, you're getting a ton of XP from the waves for the actual Slaughter Shaft and the Slaughter Stars and the Cisterns as well. So it all in all works out to be really, really good. Guys, if you've enjoyed this video, please consider subscribing to the channel or join us over on Twitch. We stream five times a week and otherwise I'll catch you on the flip.